You know, it is, it is true that, uh, that higher birth rate, weight is related to higher risk of breast cancer before menopause. It's not a very strong effect, and I don't think there's any uh, intervention implications for that. But it is a lead that is telling us that factors are operating even in utero that are influencing breast cancer risk uh, later in life. So it, bigger is higher risk, yes, for birth weight. But it, it's, it, I, it's very complicated. One of the most striking findings during the last few years that's become clear is that women who are leaner uh, before age about 12 have higher risk of, of breast cancer, which is contrary to everything we hypothesized, but this has been reproduced and it's quite strong. That so, seemed to, yeah. Yeah. so they're having some trouble hearing you, but let me tell you what he said because it won't make sense to you at yeah. first, that women overall weight is associated with a higher risk of breast cancer. By the way, that's true for prostate in men and colon cancer and everybody. But the second issue is paradoxically for girls up to age 12, if they're leaner, that's actually associated with a little higher risk, but he cautions you that that's a very small effect. Well, so you're not saying actually, plump them up, right? Right, uh, there's, so many, uh, right there, there's so many other problems with fattening them up, but it, in fact, it's a, uh, uh, it, 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 just illustrates the, it, it does illustrate the complexity of right. breast cancer, but also the point that this is a very important period in growth and development that relates from either, even being in, in utero uh, all the way uh, to late in life, there are factors operating that influence breast cancer, cancer. And it's why it's not as straightforward as cardiovascular disease. Okay. But then again, the cup, is, the cup is half full. We have identified some ways that we can help reduce our risk even now.